Hi everyone, I'm Sam, and you saw a previous video I made just a little while ago, an hour ago, I think. So today what I'll be showing you is some things I use for my tortoise. The first thing is what I use is for a shell. This is called turtle vita shell slash tortoise or terrapin. So now that you probably don't care about any of this stuff because a lot of this stuff you might use. So let's introduce the main man of this thing. This is Bamboo, and he is approximately nine months old. He's a male, and if you saw a previous YouTube channel I made, he was born without any nails at all, and this little footy, footsie right here, no nails at all. Here, you see how he has those nails? Look here, does he? Mm-mm. Alright, so this is Bamboo, and right now that you're here, I'm going to show you how you do this. Now, some of you already know, and this is boring, but this not all videos will be on how-to with your tortoise. Some of them will be a Q&A about Bamboo, or it'll just be figurative things that could help you out with this. So, right now I'm just rubbing this in to the little areas and nooks and crannies inside the shell. Now, right now, I'm just sort of presuming the feel of each little um, crack, or not crack, each little cranny in his shell to make sure it all absorbs. And if they have any nooks or any, like, chips, make sure you rub it in there. Make sure they're not soft. If they're soft, then there may be a problem. Definitely. Okay, everyone, so you saw the part about me doing a little stuff with bamboo and probably to some of you that was boring as hell so I'm not here to make you guys bored I'm here to actually help you out so comment below if you ever thought about getting a tortoise or you might want one now the only thing you gotta remember with tortoises is that they're not cheap if you want to have the proper size everything for a tortoise you want to be safe you want to make sure you're approximately positive that you want to actually have a 50 year commitment yeah these guys could live 50 years with good care and bamboo is not even oh, I'm sorry bamboo he's not even close to being the be it's the beginning of his life so pretty much today in this maybe not even 10 minute video I just want to tell you what it's like to have a tortoise so Right now I have a 40 gallon tank, and in May, which is right around the corner, I'm thinking about getting a, actually, I'm thinking about actually getting a 70 to 75 gallon tank, actually. Just something where I know that he'll be happy and he, he could live in it his whole life. And I'm pretty sure, and I know, actually, I know that a 50 is ex more than what they need. And I always wanted to have, I, want, I always want Bamboo to be happy. So, here's Bamboo right now. And the thing you gotta make sure of is that you see how their nails are kind of long. Well, these guys, you have somebody that actually have to file their nails. See how you see that part? Here, let's see if it works. Oh, it's like clear. Just like with us, or with dogs. You file it until you see the pink of their nail. Now, these guys, the pink is that black. You only want to file down to that area. So, as you can see, I should file some soon. And that's actually, they do need their nails. And you should also file to a point. You could cut them, but I suggest not to because one mistake could lead them to an infection. And you do not want to give these guys infections. The second thing that's great about having a tortoise is that they love to eat. And it's pretty much amazing to see them eat. So in the next clip, I'll be showing you what Bam... During, ugh, can't speak today. Next video, I'll be showing you bamboo eating okay everyone so I have a special friend here with me and her name's Amanda and she is I'm in Chicago I'm in Chicago and this surprisingly she's in Pennsylvania so we're pretty far away from each other so where I was at the beginning is that I feed bamboo a mixture and a lot of people feed their tortoises just either lettuce or just carrots and they cannot only specify in one kind of food they should always be have a variety. 
So with bamboo, he usually has baby lettuce, oak leaf, red leaf, butter lettuce, um, spinach, arugula, radicchio, and dandelion leaves. So they always like an assortment, and usually I either chop up a cucumber or I chop up a carrot to put inside to give him that extra vitamin, and that's pure, you know. And also what I scatter on top of his food that could give him all his proper vitamins is this. Now not all tortoises like to eat their food with this, but a lot do. It's It smells like shit, literally. But if your tortoise likes it, then you know it's good. Now, I have a European tortoise, even though he's from Russia. They suggested this. And it has everything that we need, just like them. Vitamin A, vitamin D, phosphorus, calcium. The things that we need that they also need too. They also need humidity. With bamboo's tank, I usually get a, a, a concoction cup and I put a squirt bottle on top and I put the water on the tank to give him the moisture he needs. So, right now, this is what I give him. And this is organic because he eats just like me, healthy as ever. So, right now, I'm just going to give you a little uh, quick video of this little guy eating. Right now this little guy is eating and he's a pretty good eater. He will literally eat all of that. Now as you can see there is a couple brown spots and I'll probably throw that away because usually even though this stuff could last about two weeks in amount, by a week usually it's already getting brown and starts to stink. If you notice brown or stink in the food, I suggest if you wouldn't want to eat it, neither would he. So, I'll show you a little video of this guy eating. And as you can see, his water bowl, his dry food with a little water, and another water bowl. Now, he usually tears up his tank pretty fast. So, right now, I'll just show you. This is a, I use under, under pot things that drain the water. And they actually work very well because they're non-toxic and they can't hurt them with the paint because there is no paint it's just sculpted clay so here's a little video of bamboo and i hope you guys enjoy talk to you later